What is going on YouTube? Welcome to an all new Call of Duty World War II commentary. This is Incarnate Slayer coming at you with a new commentary for the first time in a, in a long time. And I gotta say, my favorite game mode in Call of Duty World War II is the war game mode. So this is how war works. There is about four sections of war. The first section is you have to capture the command post. Now what I recommend for capturing the command post is to use an infantry setup uh, either an assault rifle or an SMG and to throw your grenades. You want to utilize your grenades as much as possible to capture this command post and also if you notice in many of the clips uh, for the infantry part I actually pre-fire before I go around the corner. That is important for this game. It is important to predict where your enemies will be and then pre-fire your gun before you show up around the corner. That way you can capture the command post. Alright, let's move on to part two which is building the bridge. This is a cool part of the game. You get to actually either build a bridge or defend the bridge and prevent it from being built and if you build the bridge your tank gets to move along the bridge to the next part of the game however you got to be mindful of snipers on this area I would recommend using your mountain setup your sniper setup if you are going to build the bridge or defending the bridge because it is better to post up with a sniper rifle and to pick off your enemies either when you're defending the bridge and the other uh, other opposite team is building it you can snipe your enemies across the map or if you're building the bridge you can snipe the enemies that are defending uh, the other side of the map so I recommend a sniper for this area and then when we move on to the second area this is all about breaching and planting the bomb or defusing the bomb for this setup, I recommend using the infantry setup once again. Uh, an assault rifle is good. And you just want to uh, make sure that you breach the wall and then you charge in as fast as you can and clear out the enemies. And then finally, the last stage is to either defend the tank or to fight off the tank. Now this one, you want to use a couple of setups. So either infantry or the mountain setup. The mountain setup is important for if you're sniping uh, the uh, crew members off the tank. You want to be mindful of the members that are on the gun of the tank. That is important to take them off there as soon as possible. And uh, also use the flamethrower if you get the chance. This can really clear enemies away from the tank and prevent the other team from getting the tank to your side of the map. Uh, and if you're actually uh, on the side where you're advancing with the tank, then you want to make sure you use the tank for cover. That is the most important thing that I can recommend in this board game mode is use the tank for cover, jump to the next cover, either use a crate or a barrel for cover and stay under cover. In Call of Duty World War II, that is the most important thing to utilize is cover. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the Call of Duty World War II private beta and I hope to see you guys online and I hope to see you guys in November when Call of Duty World War II is released. Subscribe for more Call of Duty World War II private beta gameplay on Incarnate Media Entertainment.